a drop of rain becomes an LSC and you always be a part of me it's giving the hedgehog is it a heart we share seeds of greatness is a small empathy holds it while you're all it all Nothing's worth a set in the blue ocean. Chips Ahoy and Hershey's. Also try our fudge filled cookies. In Persona 5 Tactica, your success in battling the oppressive legionnaires will hinge on your mastery of the techniques available to you on the battlefield. Be on the lookout for interactive elements on each stage that your team can take advantage of. Explosive barrels can blow up nearby enemies, while dash squares let you quickly move from one high point to another. However, some elements aren't as helpful, like surveillance cameras that call for enemy reinforcements if tripped. Speaking of enemies, you'll have to strategize for some much differently than others. Think twice before getting too close to a sumo maton. He'll toss around anyone who gets near him, whether they're on his side or not. The guarded geisha can block any type of attack from the front. And don't get too confused by the clone slimy shinobi makes of itself. Sometimes the best action is to simply observe your surroundings. If a character takes no action during battle, they'll begin their next turn with a charge. Each character has their own unique charge action, so be sure to try out different ones for the right situation in combat. You'll have to wait and see what happens. And if you want to get the most out of your team in combat, head over to the Velvet Room where you can fuse personas to create new ones, as well as craft new powerful weapons. To create a new weapon, you'll need two personas that fit the requirements of the weapon you want to make. Once you have the necessary personas, you can fuse them together to make a unique weapon that you can't buy in the store. How's that for heating up the battlefield? Upgrading your arsenal will only get you so far, though. In order to maximize each squad member's capabilities, you'll want to equip each one with the right sub-persona. Equipping a sub-persona not only increases the character's stats, but also enables the use of that sub-persona's unique and inherited skills. Be sure to find the right combination of sub-personas for each character in your squad. If you ever really want to challenge yourself, turn the difficulty up to hard or higher levels where enemies don't just become stronger. Friendly fire will also be turned on, so your attacks can hit your own party members as well. Luckily, you can retry as many times as you want, so don't be afraid to see how far you can take the fight against Legionnaires. And as always, Keep fighting. Now let's continue on. Ignite your heart when Persona 5 Tactica releases on November 17th, 2023. Pre orders are available now. I see it, I see you, and that was all that I reach, endless possibilities.